Christian Mission Aid began in 1986 as a cross-denominational, non-profit organization to help with Africa's development. Our mission is to have a holistic ministry that meets the spiritual, physical, economic, and emotional needs of people, just as Christ demonstrated during His days on earth. We desire to be a bridge between the resources and the needs, with a mandate to train communities, along with influential leaders, pastors, and church elders, to become effective advocates to address poverty and the needs of the African child, aid survivors of war and natural disasters, as well as people living with diseases like HIV-AIDS. Our programs include Christian outreach, children's ministry, community development, and aid and relief. Christian outreach is the pillar of our organization. This program encompasses deaf ministry, church planning and construction, film ministry, as well as evangelism. Our goal is to see churches empowered to perpetuate the growth of the Christian faith, as well as being able to take the lead in social and economic development in their communities. CMA equips lay leaders and pastors, taking them through lay leaders training and empowering them to do effective ministry in their community. We also distribute Bibles to unreached groups, give bicycles to pastors who sometimes walk up to 20 miles doing follow-up visits, and show the Jesus Film, a vital tool that has transformed lives in Africa. With help from our friends and partners, we reach out to the orphans and destitute children in Africa by supplying school stationery, books, desks, beds, medicines, meals, and clothing. We facilitate youth camps and vacation Bible schools, mentoring children along with giving them spiritual nourishment. During special occasions like Christmas, CMA gives children and their families Christmas buckets with food in them that would last for two weeks for a family living in the slums. We also host Christmas dinners for destitute children at Christmas time, giving them even more reason to rejoice in Christ's birth. Through the Community Leaders Educated AIDS Response, or CLEAR program, CMA has been in the forefront of the battle against HIV AIDS in Kenya. This scourge kills over 700 people every day, robbing Kenya of its productive workforce. Through this program, CMA is offering home-based care, as well as building homes for widows and children, and much more. CMA also has a drought recovery program called the Student Teacher Environmental Program, or STEP. It teaches students about the importance of planting trees and vegetables in semi-arid areas around Maasai land and Machakos. In Africa, millions of people have no access to clean water. This situation has led to a recent outbreak of cholera in Kenya and many other waterborne diseases. Christian Mission Aid, in partnership with the Water School, trains people in the SOTAS method of water purification, teaching them to disinfect water using our God-given gift of the rays of the sun. Literally thousands in Kenya and Uganda are implementing this simple method to avoid falling ill due to waterborne diseases. For over two decades, Sudan was embroiled in a brutal civil war, which pitted the country against itself. The war killed more than two million people and left hundreds of thousands more severely maimed. With virtually no infrastructure in place, it's up to CMA to provide basic health care and health care training to Sudanese nationals. People walk, sometimes for hundreds of miles, to access Christian Mission Aid's health care facilities. Those include the dental program, the expanded immunization program, and comprehensive eye care service, which also offers surgical services to patients suffering from cataracts and trachoma, both common eye illnesses in South Sudan. CMA also conducts nutritional surveys, needs assessments, as well as capacity building. We also deliver emergency food aid and tools as the need arises. To our friends and partners, we say thank you for your continued support. 
Because of your prayers and your financial gifts, you're touching, transforming, and saving thousands of lives in Africa.